Obsession Bose presents Primal Instinct. Good afternoon, this is your captain speaking with just a little flight information. We're flying at an altitude of 37,000 feet and our airspeed is 400 miles an hour. A couple little facts here, I'm packing a Colt King Cobra, that's a 357 caliber firearm with a black rubber grip and a 6 inch barrel. Also, the co-pilot is carrying a Kimber Custom Defense pistol with all the bells and whistles you'd expect from a custom gun of that kind with an alloy frame and bevel treatment on the entire gun. And our chief flight attendant, Roger, has a Ruger Bearcat 22 with a hand-fluted cylinder. You can just sit back and relax and enjoy the rest of the flight. Texas and our good friends from Ultimate Wild were nice enough to invite us down to join them on a call hunt. Uh, we just some couple of the guys got started this morning, knocked down three bucks. So uh, we're pumped up to say the least to get out there and get in our stands. But we took the right approach. We're gonna take our time, slip in the night, get in the blind, and hopefully start this hunt off the right way. And this is all about uh, two companies coming together, a new partner of ours, uh, joining forces, getting to know each other, putting some synergy together, and laying down some deer here in Texas. Yeah, we're not in Kansas anymore. Look at our little friends here. <laughs> <laughs> Texas, the Lone Star State. Texas is a large state in the southern U.S. with deserts, pine forests, and the Rio Grande, a river that forms its border with Mexico. The second largest state and known for black gold, Texas tea, longhorns, whiskey, guns, cowboys, and of course, barbecues. Instinct is brought to you by Outdoor Edge. Makers just found a poacher's camp. This is a seat in the house for those who play by their own. Alright, we're down here in Texas at uh, Alice. 
some divide ranch and uh, our buddy Troy brought us down. Uh, we're down here hanging out with the, with the crew from Ultima Wild Cases. We're down here doing some doing some management, harvesting. Uh, got my man Gary, aka Gurgle Gut, on the microphone, uh, on the camera. And we're uh, we're uh, we just got in here, got everything set up. We're in this little juniper covered in uh, drainage. So that, uh, there's a ton of sign in here, so there's deer here, no doubt. So just getting settled. We've both pounded ourselves a Snickers because we're going to be here a while. And uh, we're ready to do it. There we go. yards. He's in the straight yoga pose, son. That's the back flip roni special. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. This guy came in. He was about 33, 34 yards away. He quartered away perfect. Um, and I'm just you know, since I got down here, they've been talking about cactuses this and jumping dog pears. And so, homie don't play that. And so it was either heart or miss for me. Um, and as you can see, obviously it was not the miss. Um, so, you know, I can't, you know, Troy down here at Allison Divide Ranch. I mean, amazing. I mean, they, uh, they're starting to put in some good management work down here. Um, you know, Aaron from uh, Ultimate Wild, good looking out, homie. Uh, Scott Sierra, Chris, hope your night went as good as ours. Gary, way to put this, way to put the film down, brother. Thanks, everybody. Uh, got another tag to fill, so uh, we're gonna get this thing taken care of and love, peace, and chicken grease. I'm out. <laughs>
so I'm probably gonna come back here in the afternoon. It's real windy this morning, so just gonna have to try it again this afternoon and see what happens. Exciting morning in the brush blind is an understatement. And the second we got in there, we just had bucks on us all morning. And finally, this tall ball came in, management deal here on the farm, and uh, gave me a perfect shot. I liver hit him uh, a little lower than I want to, but these deer are on edge, and I thought he might drop, but we just stood right there. And the ram cat and the injection did the job, so we're happy to get on the board here in Texas. We're going to get, uh, get it loaded up, get back to camp, and get back after it tonight and see if we can get another one down. 
Patients don't call for a stay. Got through the rain. I like Ori. Who thrives on the unexpected. I'm going to the bank. Event in the history of firearms. Gun stories and all new. The greater challenge is hunting during early season is keeping our game from spoiling after harvest. Until now, let's join Brad Lockwood as we take a closer look at the Kula Buck. Kula Buck is the first ever collapsible and poor large deer. Tradition. Now I got some good shooting plan. I did it and it was just uh, every year in the dark and finally got light. And I've run the ground ever since. Uh, they're chasing deer in Texas.